Welcome back. Hi everyone. Today we'll learn how to install Android TV on your on any PC or any LED that has system. Okay, first part, all you need to do is make a bootable USB. The tool you need in the description, it's Rufus and an image file. So here is an image file, ATV. I'll provide in the description. And another tool that you need to flash the USB as bootable is Rufus. I also provide uh, that in the description below. So once you have that, plug your USB and run the Rufus as admin. There you go. Now select your USB and check the image that you have downloaded. There you go, my image. And choose FAT32 because it will need FAT32. I don't know why they mentioned that. And rename as you like and make sure you select that GPT on. Now click start and yes and OK. Now your USB will be flashed. So don't worry, just wait and let it done. I'll be back. Okay, back, there you go, my USB is done. So next thing you need to do is extract that data as extracted here or open it with WinRAR and drag that image to the root of this file. Now go to your PC. Okay, second part, plug your USB to your system. Now you have to boot from the USB. I need to restart and my boot key is F12. You have different PC, so check your boot sequence. It would be like uh, F12, F9, or in some cases, escape or etc. So check it as your model, as your maker made it. So let it boot. Hi, it's me. There you go, my sequence is now boot, please wait. Now wait, here you go, my USB. I'm gonna select this. And now, there are two possible ways. You can either use it directly or you can flash from the USB. So first I'm gonna check that direct case. There you go, it's booting from my USB. Just wait. Be patient, don't unplug or power off. After a few minutes, wait. There you go, my Google is launched. My ATV is ready to use. Second part of this video, I'll show you how to install it on your hard drive. You don't need any USB to boot, so. First, let it boot. I'm gonna show you what it cost. If you are new to our channel, kindly like, subscribe, share, and comments. It's booting from my USB and taking a little bit of time because it's first time and first time might be a little bit slow, so don't worry. And there you go. It's asking me for language. My language is like English. So I'm gonna skip this part or I'm gonna show you. Okay, enter. Wait again. Now select the Wi Fi. I will enter my key of Wi Fi and I'll be back. Wait. There you go. I already entered my uh, Wi Fi key. So it's checking for connectivity across the internet. Connect successfully. There you go. 
now you player what our player you like there are different options and choose this one there you go just wait a little bit more let it roll there you go I have different apps in it and different more options here and all that Google player YouTube player other player and you can install more on from the Play Store here you go my YouTube is working and that's it now next part of this video how to install this Android TV to your Android source to your Windows source without using USB so you can boot directly from the hard drive so as I'm going to show you that my YouTube is working many people claim that YouTube is didn't work after it there you go nice Celtronics channel now we'll play everything is working so fine mint condition next part all right this time how to install plug the usb again and select this installation option and then wait a little bit there you go select your partition which partition you want to format click yes and there you have to create a partition i just want to create single partition so i'll delete all of them after creating that format it and format it in xt4 f4 xt4 partition format and now just wait let it format don't use any other like fat32 and dfs as a crack code it's not for and write for and write it's ext4 partition The speed is bent on your hard drive. My mine is here is 500 GB and simple drive no SSD. After format, it will start installation, and on finalizing, it will choose update and installation. So be patient in it. It will take at least like 15 to 20 minutes. Don't unplug and don't do anything rubbish. There you go, formatting is completed. Now we can wait to let it install. The whole process is like 15 minutes, so don't mess with anything. There you go, it will be start in a few seconds. There you can see. 
CMD is auto running so it seems that it's processing something so don't worry about it just wait There you go, my code is running completed, so it will show another screen on in just few minutes, few seconds, not minutes. There you go. If you want to install update, click OK. And let it be process. Once it's complete, it will ask you if you want to reboot or just want to start. So I'll choose start. And now my Android is running from inside hard drive, no USB. The process will again like start from English, Wi-Fi, etc. So choose it. I just plug my wireless mouse here. Choose different right here, so the menu is a little bit different. I'll provide all these and right in the list as you like again English again yes again yes and Wi-Fi once again I remember Windows 10 when it started saying a little ding wing there and a little Wi-Fi here so do this thing So now it's checking for updates. It's already been updated, so no need to. But let it check. If you want to sign into your Play Store, you can sign in here.
There you go, final touches, and my Play Store, YouTube, everything is here now. So it's high series open. <laughs> okay, when I say open Celtronics, it just couldn't recognize me. Let's try it again. Not cell phonics, it's Celtronics, idiot. Celtronics. Okay, just leave it. Go to Play Store and you can have some apps here. And if you want to install apps manually, you can install manually from file browser, which we will guide you later on. So, first, search Chrome. And there is Chrome built in. That's good. You can install application from Chrome as well. Type the application name and space and then APK. APK is the file type. As you can see in uh, our PC, it's .exe or .zip. So here it's APK. Basically, is a file package for using for Android devices. Here you go. Things are installing, things are playing, and everything is okay. Here is the file browser. You can install files from here as well. Plug your USB, click on the device. Okay, there is some issue in this Android. I'm going to change my Android version, and I'm going to try again. So, thanks for watching. Thanks for giving us time. Thanks for everything. God bless us all. God bless you. See you in the next video very soon. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, comments. Any queries in comments, I will love to answer you. Thank you. See you in the next video very soon.